Saudi Arabia is building a luxury snow destination in the desert. Tourist destinations need to be unique to attract tourists, so today we're here with an upcoming tourist destination about to take millions hearts. Hello folks, we're back with another video titled Saudi Arabia is building a luxury snow destination in the desert. Here we go! The 500 billion US dollar mega project Neom has below freezing winter temperatures regularly and year round averages around 10 degrees Celsius lower than the rest of the nation. The location is slated to become a winter wonderland with heights ranging from 1500 meters to 2600 meters, spanning an area of around 60 square kilometers. Outdoor skiing in a resort in the desert is a unique experience that Trojena will offer because it has never been done before in the region, especially in Gulf nations known for their dry temperatures. By 2030, the development of Trojena, which is slated for completion in 2026, hopes to welcome 700,000 tourists and 7,000 permanent residents. A controversy also surrounds the newest of Saudi Arabia's infrastructure projects. Of course, we're referring to Trojena, a ski resort in the desert. Trojena will be built in the nation's northwest, close to Tabuku, with about 500,000 residents. The $500 billion Neo Mega Project will include Trojena, which will draw affluent clients to Saudi Arabia and offer them everything from diving in the Red Sea to skiing on artificial slopes. To make these Winter Games a first-ever worldwide event, Trojena will have the infrastructure necessary to simulate a winter climate in the middle of a desert, according to Neom CEO Nadmi Al Nasser. One of the ten areas being constructed as part of Saudi Arabia's Neom region is the Trojena Resort. It will be connected to the Mega City Line, which is being constructed as another critical aspect of the growth of Neom. The primary development of the Ski Village is scheduled to start at the end of 2022. However, work on this resort has already started. Neom has acquired a contract with Much More, the lifestyle hospitality company with the fastest growth worldwide. Two of Ennismore's renowned brands will collaborate. Morgan's Originals and 25 Hours Hotels will open properties in Gina for the next few years. Trojena will host the ninth Asian Winter Games in 2029, the Neom project formally revealed on October 4th, 2022. Saudi Arabia must demonstrate exceptional infrastructure and enormous capacity to host and organize this significant sporting event. Saudi Arabia wants to present their nation as one of the world's top sports nations. Being the first Middle Eastern nation to host the Asian Winter Games, Saudi Arabia undertook the project as part of its plan and strategy to assist and grow the region's tourism industry. Industry is huge and so is tourism. Subscribe to Grand Projects and don't miss an update on what's happening in the world. Also, do like, share, and comment any new project you would like us to cover. Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman has stated that Trojena will redefine mountain tourism for the world by developing a location based on ecotourism principles, highlighting initiatives to preserve nature and improve the quality of life in the community, all of which are in line with the objectives of the Kingdom's Vision 2030. The Prince also stated that all building work would follow Neom's strict environmental guidelines which include a commitment to minimizing the impact on the local ecology and ensuring sustainability over the long term. Trojena is anticipated to significantly contribute to regional tourism since it demonstrates how Saudi Arabia is developing destinations based on its diverse geography and ecosystem. This development will give the country a new source of revenue to help it diversify its economy while protecting its natural resources for future generations. Although a promotional film depicts dozens of runs and natural snowfall, it is still being determined from the early statements how much skiing will be available and how the snow will be kept in place. The temperatures in the area are said to be 10 degrees lower than the average temperature in Saudi Arabia, which ranges from 10 to 45 degrees Celsius, 50 to 110 Fahrenheit, often very close to freezing. Its building is part of a larger drive toward winter sports in Saudi Arabia, which has a growing number of indoor snow centers and is now building Ski Saudi, one of the most extensive indoor snow facilities in the world. Moreover, Saudi Arabia is forming a global snowboarding and skiing squad. An international team of architects, including the UK firm Zaha Hadid Architects, the Netherlands firm UN Studio, the German firm Lava, and the Australian studio Aidas, is creating Trojena. 
The development's tunnel-shaped master plan was made by Lava, and Neom called it a futuristic folded vertical community. Bureau Proberts will construct an artificial freshwater lake in addition to the hamlet, and Zaha Hadid architects will come up with other design components, according to Neom. By 2030, Trojena hopes to draw 700,000 tourists and 7,000 permanent residents. The development will also have opulent homes with expansive views intended to capture the beauty of the surroundings and the slope residences, which will be situated next to the ski slope overlooking the lake. A location unlike any other on Earth, Trojena will feature six unique development districts built upon customized experiences that combine real with virtual architectural and engineering innovations. The primary attractions in Trojena include a ski village, the vault, the lake, the wildlife reserve, the observatory, the bow, and the ultra-luxury residences. The districts are called Gateway, Discover, Valley, Explore, Relax, and Fun. The ultra-luxury mansions in Trojena transform the town into a hub for outdoor entertainment, fine dining, and stargazing that blend perfectly with the natural surroundings. The top architects in the world created these unique homes customized to the owner's needs. The views of the lake and the surrounding mountains are provided by these mansions, which are thoughtfully positioned in prime locations. 2,200 residences and more than 3,600 hotel rooms will be included in the development as a whole. The goal of Neom, according to its architects, is to preserve the area for nature by emphasizing vertical architecture and reducing the land taken. As a result, the vault will be a particular offering that protects the land without encroaching too far. It's crucial to note that tourism in the region is distinctive since it develops a destination based on its geographic and natural diversity. Skiers of all skill levels will be able to enjoy challenging runs while taking in breathtaking sights like the Red Seas, Azure Seas, the Golden Dunes of the Desert, and the majestic Neom Mountain Ranges. It'll be a unique experience that combines various locations with exciting and enjoyable moments. How the snow will be kept up is still a little uncertain. There are all-weather snowmaking devices that cover snow at temperatures considerably above freezing, but the area that needs to be covered is vast. A 170-kilometer straight-line city, a Salman-named city that is entirely non-profit, and an eight-sided city that floats on the water are all planned to be created as part of the Neom development. The total cost of the Neom project, including the Mirror Line and the Desert Ski Resort Trojena, is predicted to exceed $1 trillion. The remainder of the megacity will be completed by 2030, and the ski resort will be finished in time for the Asian Winter Games in 2029. It's an ambitious ambition, but Saudi Arabia will rank among the top Middle Eastern tourism destinations if realized. The Neom development, which spans a vast region, has drawn criticism from people worldwide since the kit has huge objectives but only a tiny portion of them have yet to be realized. The project to create a metropolis with a 170-kilometer straight line is the most well-known. There is, however, an eight-sided floating city as well. That's all for the video today. I hope you'll visit Trojena at least once. Do like, share, and comment down your views on this project. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel, Grand Projects.